Good morning, Internet. This is Alex Das Sudokus, and it is Thursday, the 8th of July, 2021. And we're going to tackle today's New York Times hard Sudoku. So let's jump it, r jump right in with um, some Snyder notations um, where we pencil marking numbers with occurrences of two in any boxes. Any less than that, we have the number. Any more than that, we're going to leave them alone. So, um, this one here blocks the ones into rows four and five. So, I've already got four and five in this box as well. So, if the ones locked on rows four and five in two boxes, I know it must be on row six in the remaining box. So, that forms another X-wing where well, another situation where the ones are locked on columns four and five now. So column six must have a one, so that unlocks another one, which unlocks another one here, thanks to these two ones on a row and one on a column, which unlocks another one here. So ones are quite successful. Got two over here, thanks to these twos, and that two over there, which unlocks another two here, which alongside this two gives me a pair of twos down at the bottom. Got another pair of twos there, and I think they're sort of twos, so that's good. Three is on its own, so we call it a naked, uh, not a naked, I think it's a weak number. Um, I like to play with weak numbers because quite often I find naked singles along with the weak numbers. So I'm trying to see what cell looks promising. So here I've got one, two, three, four six so missing five and eight there that is not useful i've got six and eight here one two three four S missing a five i've got six seven eight and missing a nine no hold on one two three four missing oh yeah missing five and nine here so there may still be a naked single nearby, but maybe it's not ready yet. Oh, the three and the nine are both weak. Okay, three and the nine are both weak. So what we like to do then is look at where they overlap. So one, two, three, four. I'm missing a five, but is it possible that there's actually a pointing pair of fives? Not that I can see, so I'm gonna move on in that case and put a four over here. Um, these two fours. And that four locks a four down, so I have a pair of fours down at the bottom. Uh, four, 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 four. Fives are not giving me any things at all. No. Sixes, got a pair of sixes over here. Pair of sixes up top. And I think that's all the sixes. Sevens are here, here, in these three cells. Mm, not super helpful. Am I missing something? I feel I'm missing something with the sevens. Tell you what, I am missing is a tissue to blow my nose. So one moment, please. Okay, um, what I was going to do, well I can place an 8 in here, thanks to these two 8s, so that unlocks a 7, which means the 7s are also locked in these two cells. Any other revelations with the 7s? No. What about the 8s? Can I do more with the 8s? Ah, annoyingly, no. Okay, so we know the 3 and the 9 are weak, but there are no pointing 5s. So I don't think we can solve anything, but if we focus on a nine, maybe we can find a three. So we want to at least see a five. So what about here? That cell sees a five. And I've got one, two, missing a three. I've got four, five, six, missing seven and eight as well. So hmm, that's no good. So let's have a look at this column. This column is missing three, four, six, and five. Three, four, six, and five. No, I'm not going to get anything out of that. So sometimes it's worth just doing a second scan of the puzzle. And I think 
this is one of those times. Morning, Liari. Sorry, missed your message, message there for a second. Um, how are you today? Um, okay, actually, I'm, I've got a triple here, which is three, nine, and eight. Also not useful, but I'm going to pencil mark them in. Um, actually, yeah, let's tackle the weak areas first and see if we have anything. So I'm missing five, nine, and eight. Got an eight there, got an eight there. So this is actually a pair of eight up top that I've missed previously. That was a bit silly of me, wasn't it? Um, this is a triple as well, which is six, nine, and four. So fours are pointed, which means another pair of fours here. This four forces a pointing pair of fours, basically. So yeah, I think it is worth having another scan of the puzzle because um, I think we're missing some vital information. But I'm going to pencil mark in the six and the nines because the no six or nines looking into the box. So this is what we're doing. Um, any other weak areas? Um, we haven't actually finished looking at this one. So this is, oh, oh, oh. This is six and eight, actually, because I've got the sixes there as well. So these are fives and nines. Okay, if those are fives and nines, oops, then these are quite weak now. But not quite weak enough. Uh, five and nine, so this is a quadruple, which includes the twos, threes, six and four. And I haven't got any three or fours at all. Annoying, annoying. Six and eight, what about them? Well, they lock in a pair of nines over there. Um, and fives are actually in these two cells, forming a pointing pair of fives. And I've got threes remaining, which can go everywhere. But... No buts. That's it. That's all I found. Okay. What about this row? This row is now three, f oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Something's not right. Yep, the six is not actually there. So the eight and the six are actually solved. So this is three, five, and seven. Three, five, and seven, not useful. Not useful at all. Frustrating. Um, okay, let's move on. This is three, six, seven, and nine. Shut up, Siri. Six and nine so this is seven and eight anything going on one six nine one six eight and nine so i've got one and eight that's six and nine that means i've got a pair of six and nines so these are ones and eight okay if we've got ones and eight there we have ourselves a pair of sixes that are pointed upwards not particularly useful, but it's something. And we can't ignore something. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh. The threes and the nines, are, they're still definitely giving me trouble, but I do notice the nines are locked in these cells. As far well as the sevens, the seven and nines are locked in these cells, but I haven't got a third number. Yeah, they're not particularly useful because whilst I've got the nines locked on rows seven and nine, this is not helpful. I've got nines locked in three possible positions. So let's continue looking at the weak areas. This is three, four, six, and three, four, five, and six. And we've got four and six there. No, I've got four there. No six. Um, I've got four and nine on the row. So I think that's three and six. Um, oh, that's interesting. If we look at, oh no, this is a, this is a quintuple quintuplet so we can't do that never mind three nine eight and five 
okay, I'm not getting anything. I'm not getting anything. So I'm just going to scan the puzzle again from scratch. Wow, for a start. Oh, no, no, never mind. I thought I saw something, but I didn't. It was a knee-jerk reaction to me not getting any numbers. I don't really want a pencil mark in the threes here, but I feel I may have to. And that's a sad time. Four, 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 four. Fives. Mm. Nope, not really restricted enough. Sixes are locked in here. Along with nothing else. Uh, oh, actually, this is not a six. This six had opened up the six over there. So that gives us another six. So that was ca careless of me. Because I've got a six here now. So I've got a four and nine as a matching pair, which means the nines are now pointed now. I finally have some more nines because I've got nine here now, which opens up the five and the nine over here. And this five unlocks a pair of fives over there. Um, okay, what else does this nine do? Still locks in the nine there. This is three, nine and five. I've got three and five there. So this must be a nine, leaving me three and five. Okie doke. Um, fives are actually pointed here, thanks to this five. So three and five are as such. And this is now a triple of five, seven, and eight. Got an eight there, got a seven there, got a five there. So not good cheap. But if this is five, seven, and eight, this must be a three, which gives me a pair of threes at the bottom. These are three, four, five, and seven. Okay, sevens go in these two cells. Which means the only place for the seven goes he. No, which means this can't be a seven. So I must be a four then, because it can't be any other numbers. In fact, I've got five over here unlocking. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, I've got seven, five, and three. So that must be a four. Uh, it gives me a five, which means these are threes and sevens. Okay. Oops. Does a five bring me more joy? You've got a pair of fives over there. Four. Oh, my sniffles are coming. My sniffles are coming. My nose is really like itchy. And it's of the it's of the sneezing variety, and that's not good. Many apologies. Uh, four and nine here unlocks a five. So I'm a bit dark. Mm, not sure if that helps. But this five unlocks a five down here, which unlocks a seven, one, and two, thanks to Snyder notation, because every number erases one of the pencil markings. So that's Gucci. And this one unlocks the one and the eight, which means the eights are down here. In fact, over here, because I've got a pointing pair of eights blocking that cell, and this eight blocks that cell. Um, can I finish the eight? No, I can't. Can I finish something here, though? Well, I can finish a nine over there, because the nine can't go in this cell on this column, which gives me a three as the other number. So seven and three are resolved, and that means I've got a pair of threes over here. Um, these are therefore fours and twos, must go this way because of that four. And these are fours and nines. I can't resolve them. These are fours and threes. God damn it. Are we really that close and that far away? This three is unlocked, which means, oops, a pair of threes over there. Three, five, seven. This is seven and eight. Not useful. Okay, I think these columns are probably what breaks the puzzle. So three, four, and nine. I've got a three there. I have no four and nine. This is four and nine. This is a four nine pair, isn't it? Oh, hello. What's going on? Oh, no. Four and nine. Oh, this is irregular. But I just noticed this is three and six unlocked because of that six there. So that unlocks a three up top, a five, 
9 and 7. I think that's correct. So 4 and 9 are there. 9 is now locked in this cell, which gives me an 8 and a 3. 5 is over there now. And this must be a 7. And that would be an 8. Okay, the 9 unlocks the 9 and a 4 down here, which gives me 4 and 3. And that's today's New York Times Hard Sudoku. Right, so for anyone watching on YouTube, I hope that proved useful. Um, I think today's mostly dealing with not necessarily X wings, but um, fantastic. Some numbers being sold you remained by, resolute yes, and um, resourceful oh, in an being, atmosphere of you know, extreme pessimism. For some reason, which is annoying. The sounds are not working. Maybe I should use my speaker, my headphones. But yeah, thank you very much. Um, and um, if you enjoy that, oh no, don't apologize at all. It's not you, it's not you at all, it's my, my sound being a bit up, but in fact, I'm going to restart. So hopefully, I'm going to hear something this time. I should really test my sounds beforehand. Um, but yes, if you're watching on YouTube, please do give me a subscription if you want to become one of the gel, one of the cellmates on my grid. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just trying to make, make it a thing. I'm going to make this place my dungeon and... We have cells, cages, and whatever. So maybe that's what we do. And you can be a number. Um, but yeah, I do this on a daily basis. So yeah, give me a subscription if you like to see more. And I shall see you tomorrow. Bye now.